Hi, I'm Neil of Team Teacher, teaching, living and raising a family in China. Today, we're going to look at the air quality in Vancouver, Canada to Shenzhen, China. Let's check it out. So it's a beautiful sunny day right now in Vancouver and I'm on the Georgia Viaduct which is a super busy highway leading to the downtown core. Uh, we're looking at the air quality and the air quality right now has been fluctuating uh, from about 12 to 15 PM 2.5 particles which is actually uh, as stated by the WHO in the short term risk category uh, for air quality. What we want is we actually want it below uh, 10 PM 2.5 particles. So right now it's not ideal. It's a beautiful sunny day and we're in downtown Shenzhen and we're right by a really busy highway called Binhei and we're looking at the air quality right now. The air quality right now is actually above the recommended short-term uh, particle amount for the PM 2.5s. It's actually at 35 PM 2.5 particles, which is in the bad area. So you can see being downtown with lots of traffic and congestion in the big buildings and lack of airflow uh, has a greater impact on the pollution and the air quality. Hi, I'm in Shenzhen Bay Park, which is by the ocean on this beautiful sunny summer's day. And I'm taking some readings for the air quality. The air quality right now is about 12 PM 2.5 particles. I'm in Stanley Park by the ocean on this beautiful day and I'm looking at the air quality readings. As you can see now, it's 8 PM 2.5 particles. So as you can see from these readings we did, the areas where there's a lot more congestion in the city core, where there's more people, more cars, more building, the reading will be poorer. And as we get away from the city into more nature, to a park uh, where there's more trees, by the ocean even, the readings will improve. Well, I hope you found that video informative. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel. Bye-bye.